Hi, this is Boyz having a lovely hair day. So today I'm going to share with you my goals that I want to accomplish in 2018. Um, a couple days before New Year's Eve on 2017, I told myself that I really wanted to lose weight. I was originally 165 pounds, and I know what you're saying, that may not be bad, but um, about a, uh, I'd say like a year or two ago, I was 180 pounds, and at my age, I'm considered, I was considered obese. But um, I told myself that I wanted to um, be at 150 pounds and just to lose weight and just try my hardest. And I am proud to say that I have successfully completed my goal and I am around 150 pounds. Um, I think I'm 151 or 155, but I just consider that 150 pounds. So I'm just excited that I have did that. And um, now since I successfully completed that I wanted to um, try and see if I can complete more goals so I set more goals and they're not really related to my weight they're more of like um, trying to build my um, just my 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 spirit and I I don't really know but it's um my goals are just related to my life and um, what I want to um, how I want to grow so um, my first goal is that um, I want to finish learning French so that I can be fluent in it. I started learning French a couple months ago and I'm still learning French and I just want to be fluent in it so my goal for 2018 is to be fluent in French and I'm still in the middle of learning but I really want to get fluent. And then the next goal is I want to learn more Spanish and hopefully be fluent in it as well. I am, um, I don't know if you guys know this but I am half Honduran and half um, just Caucasian and um, with I just really want to learn like my culture and Spanish because Spanish is really helpful to, um, to know like in everyday life because mo the majority of people speak Spanish like that's like the second most known language besides um, the first one which is English but um, I just really want to be Spanish um, just fluent in Spanish I mean just so that I could um, speak to my family member because some, some of my family members they don't really speak that much English so I just want to be able to speak to them and um, speak to others and um, that speak Spanish and the next one is I want to journal more and write my thoughts down so I can look back at my life in the future and um, I was trying to complete that in 2016 but I failed because uh, who has time for it? But I want to make time for um, journaling just to like um, like a couple years later just to look back and like see what was I doing on that day or you know just what was I doing when I was that age or just something like that and um, I'm just looking down at my book um, just to see what my goals are that I wrote down and then the fourth one is I want to try scrapbooking and see if it can be a hobby of mine um, I really it, scrapbooking interests me uh, I did some of it, but I have to get an actual book. Like I try, like I'm, I'm collecting the actual things that I want to put in my scrapbook, but I haven't made the scrapbook yet. But I do have the items that I want to put in it once I get a scrapbook. So I just want to see if maybe if that could be a hobby of mine that I can um, just if I can just explore. Because the only hobby of mine really is just to make videos and draw. So I want to see if maybe I have other hobbies that I just haven't um, realized that I had. And then the next one is. I want to get 100, um, 100 subscribers by the end of 2018 um, and get uh, at least 300 or 200 followers on Instagram. Um, this is not really uh, a big deal of mine. Like, I, I really, really like to get um, 100 subscribers on my excuse me. I really like to get 100 subscribers on my um, YouTube, but I'm not all about the subscribers and followers. As long as I'm helping people and I'm just. Um, Helping people in like any way possible. I'm not caring about like the, the money or like numbers I'm gonna get out of one video. I'm not just like scrolling down and refreshing to see what kind of subscribers I have now. I'm just all about helping people. But I would love it if I can get 100 subscribers by the end of the year and maybe 300 followers on Instagram. And because um, I'm originally at, I think I'm at 160, and I'm really, I'm I'm just really hopeful that I'm gonna get to there. So. Um, the sixth goal is I want to continue to exercise um, 
five times a week. I want to exercise at least five times a week or three times a week, but I'm trying to get five times a week. So the next one is I want to volunteer at the library more. So I was volunteering like every week at the library at the um, story time program, which is just reading to the kids. And I was just helping out. Um, I was just helping out someone because someone would read to the kids, read the book to the kids. But then I just help out with the other activities that they have after the book, like um, drawing or making crafts. So I help with that. And I was helping every week, but um, with my um, chronic, um, like chronic illness thing. Uh, I like I just steered off of that so I really want to try to get back to that because that really um, gave me happiness and then the next one is where is it oh the eighth one is um, uh, grow out my hair I want to grow out my hair while still focusing on the health of it now some people they will say I want to grow my hair I want to grow my hair I'm not going to care about the health of it I just want my hair to grow and then they have relaxers in their hair and it's like you're not going to get your hair to grow so what I mean by this is that like um, I want to grow out my hair. I'm not focusing on the growth. I'm just focusing on the health of it. And the growth, I would love to have some growth, but I'm still gonna focus on the, the health of it as well. Like at the same time, because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna just forget about the health of it and just try all these different things and then just make it unhealthy. Like if, I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. And then. The next one is, ninth goal is I want to start a job such as at Publix. Um, I just really want to try and see like, you know, if I can start a job and just get part time. So the next one is, um, I want to continue to lose weight while getting rid of my cellulite plus like, um, I call them arm flaps, but you know the things just go like this. I want to get rid of those too. And then the last goal is I want to continue to love myself as I am. That's one of the um, more important goals just because love, um, self-love is really important because you just can't care about all you, about your looks. You have to like, um, like love yourself on the inside. Like even if you didn't have like hair, would you still love yourself? You know what I'm saying? Like you have to love your soul. Like you could be beautiful, but um, if your like soul isn't beautiful, you're just gonna be like complimented on your looks and not your actual soul. So um, I just really want to focus on um, continuing to love myself because um, in 2000, I think early 2016, I was kind of um, I had a low self-esteem and I didn't really um, care about myself and I didn't really care about the health of myself or about anything. I was just trying to get through life, but now I'm really focusing on like um, whether I'm happy. Like, I need to be happy where in the state that I am, and um, I just need to not focus on the negatives. You know, like for example, I'm chronically ill, so um, I'm not gonna be like laying in bed all day and like I can't get up because I'm I have a chronic illness. No. Like, you can't continue to live life like that. Like, you have to make a living and do all kinds of stuff and just be proud of your life when it's the end of it. So, I'm not gonna, I'm not just gonna lay in bed all day and just say I'm chronically ill so I can't get up. I know you, your, your illness is, is chronic, so you have to find different ways to go around that and still live your life um, happy. So, um, that... Uh, that is all of my goals for 2018 and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and maybe um, like learn something out of the video uh, in the comments below tell me what you guys um, in the comments below tell me what your goals are for 2018 and how you plan to um, accomplish those goals and I hope you guys got to enjoy this video if you did um, give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe if you enjoyed my content so you can um, find other content of mine in the future and um, share this video if you enjoyed it and I love you guys so remember to wear your crown not a frown and bye